Donkey Ollie. And these are the Ten Commandments. The Ten Commandments were given to Moses by God. They tell us what our duties to God are, as well as our duties to other people. They are the most important rules we have. Hi there! Even when they were young, Elizabeth and Jehu were given good examples by their parents of the way they should behave when they themselves were grown up. We'll be home soon, Daddy. Don't worry about me. Come on, Ollie, let's go. They also learned to honor their parents who had taught them so much. The fifth commandment says, Honor your father and your mother. Honoring our parents isn't just obeying them, but it's more like remembering all the things they do for us. Elizabeth and Jehu had parents that worried about them when they were little and taught them the things they needed to know as they grew up. Jehu was crippled when he was little and his parents sent him to see Stephen with the hopes of being cured. Little Jehu, jump down, the Lord has healed you. Enough of this nonsense. Away with him. Hey! Look at me! My legs! They're healed! Thank you, Lord! They were just overjoyed when he was cured because he could have a normal life. That's what parents do. They care about us. They teach us. They want the best for us. My Aunt Alana looks after me and my brothers, right, sure. so we try to honor her the same way we would our parents. We might not always obey her, but we do try. The angel appeared to Joseph to tell him to flee with Mary and the child to Egypt. None of the other donkeys would hear of taking the trip. Well, as for me, I was just a sprig of a lass. I remember when Mary turned to me and asked me if I'd carry them. I'd never been so honored in my life. It was a long, long trip with many hardships. When we finally arrived in Egypt, I felt as if I could turn around and do the whole trip again. None of my hooves were even split. Wow, tell us some more donkey legends. In each generation, there have been donkeys that God has used for his purposes. It matters not your size or the family you're from. As Jehu and Elizabeth got older, they were always glad to see their parents. Elizabeth now has children of her own, and she gives them all the same kind of love she was given as a child. God gave you life. It is a gift he shares with your mother and your father. They honor that gift by teaching you wonderful things, like the love of God. And you can return that gift by treating them with honor and respect. <laughs> 